Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Blu-ray collection update and unboxing. If you all don't know me, I'm David Cantu, and I review movies over at CinemaDeviant.com. I started doing this as a way to give people a heads up as to what's coming out now and in the upcoming weeks as far as Blu-rays and DVDs go. Um, now, this week, we don't have a whole, whole lot, not like the, the previous week, but uh, we have some pretty good titles here, though. Uh, and I want to go ahead and just get started because, again, I like to talk sometimes, uh, and, and if I don't get started now, we'll never get started. So let's go ahead and start off with Orange is the New Black Season 4. You can see here. Honestly, I kind of dropped off of this show for a while. Um, so I need to get back in and catch up. So that way uh, I can I can watch this season. And the good thing about these uh, is that these uh, these seasons, uh, you know, of shows like this that are, that are on Netflix and things like that, they're not really that long. They don't have too, too many episodes. So that's, you know, that's, I... I Guess you could say that's a good thing about them because you can kind of run through them pretty good uh, or pretty quickly, I should say, if you if you just you know want to binge watch. Um, so, show's great though. Uh, I've always had a, a good time watching it. Um, my wife used to be into it too. Uh, I think she dropped off around the same time that I did. But uh, here goes the front here, the artwork, and this one does come out May 9th from Lionsgate, right? And then goes the back here if you guys want to know what this season is about. And the special features as well. Let's zoom in just a little bit. All right, let's go ahead and open this up. All right. Let's say on the cover, "New Blood, New Rules." Ooh. All right. Let's see. All right. All right. Does come with a digital copy. And it does come with, which it, I like this. This is very helpful. Um, this is the, uh, basically the episode list here. If you guys want to see what each episode is about. Just can pause it, pause the screen. All right. And then here goes disc one, disc two, and then disc three there. Oops, I know. This three, all right, and then here goes the front, back, and spine for Orange is the New Black season four. It comes out May 9th from Lionsgate. All right. Pop this over here. All right, next up is a movie that um, I saw a preview for. Oh, it was a while back, and uh, I already knew I was gonna hate it. But for the for the specific reason that I knew it was going to be sad, um, and, um, and that movie is a dog's purpose. Um, you know, I'm I'm not to be perfectly honest with you, I'm not really a big animal person, but I do have feelings. <laughs> I have a conscience, okay. And uh, and this uh, this movie seems like it's going to be one of those that's going to probably make my eyes sweat. As I say, but yeah, he was an adorable and heartwarming film. Jacqueline Roth, Life and Style. That's her her quote on it. And the trailer looks really cute. You know, the trailer to the movie looks like it looks looks like it's gonna be a really cute movie. Uh, so I'm, you know, I'm kind of hyped to 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 see it. Um, I'm probably gonna watch it alone <laughs> just in case. There goes the back there if you guys want to see what it's about. Now, I've already been warned. There's a couple people on Instagram that, that, that kind of, you know, told me, uh, be prepared. Because it, uh, it is a sad movie. So I'm like, ah, damn it. Anyway. All right. Let me pop this open. Ooh, no sticker. All right, it does come with digital copy. And then here you have the DVD over here on this side. It's all black. You just have the reflective uh, logo there. And then the universal, the standard universal formatted uh, Blu-ray with the little blue logo at the bottom. And like this blurred out reflected, reflective logo with the uh, reflective surface, I should say, with the, the blue logo on top. Pretty standard as far as their releases. They're all pretty consistent. Um, so I guess if anything, that's a good thing <laughs> that they're consistent. And here goes the front 
back and spine for a dog's purpose dog's purpose which is actually out now from universal home entertainment all right so again if if you're looking for a movie that that is is cute but you're looking to, for, for the waterworks this is probably one to get <laughs> i'm almost certain uh next up is shark week the shock and awe collection um, and as you can see here, it does say six disc collection only at Walmart. And this one comes out May 9th from Lionsgate. This, I, I love stuff like this. Seeing, you know, um, you know, the, these like, I guess documentaries or, or, you know, these Shark Week episodes and things like that. It, it amazes me. And right now my son is really into sharks. So, um, I, he's going to love this one as well. Uh, it came in the mail, and I, I kind of showed it to him in passing. He was like, oh, my God, can we watch it? I'm like, um, give me a bit, just to, <laughs> so that way I can do this video. And, uh, and yeah, we're, we're definitely going to watch it. So uh, and Before I open it, here goes the back here. We want to know what it's about. 32 episodes. That is crazy. And it, it, it does. It has some weight to it. And I'm very surprised that they were able to pack six discs in a single uh, DVD case, and I hope and uh, man, I, I'm already now that I said that, I hope that they're not stacked onto each other. Let's see. All right, this one is like I said, only available at Walmart. Walmart exclusive. <laughs> They're not stacked onto each other. <laughs> that is great. Okay. All right. So, this one right here, this two, this three, this four. Wait, I think I missed something. Hold on. Let's start over. <laughs> Replay. This one, this two, this three, this four, this five, and disc six. And they're all kind of standard, that the typical um, Lionsgate, you know, type of surface. But each disc, which is, this is pretty unique because even with like a, you know, TV shows and things like that, I, I've never seen them done this way from Lionsgate. Um, but they actually have the listing. Uh, you probably can't see it because it's reflective. There, there it goes. The listing of each episode, like the title. That's really cool. I like that. I like that. Lionsgate, keep that up. Keep stuff like this up. Whenever you're doing TV shows, I highly suggest keep doing that. They look good. All right. And like I said, it does uh, It does come out May 9th. Only at Walmart from Lionsgate. Next up is um, a sequel to a movie that... Um, okay. Let me rewind just a little bit. I don't typically pan movies i i don't typically give bad reviews because i try to see the good in everything i'm not gonna lie it, it's 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 very it's it's very tough for me to give a movie a really bad review because i i i'm sympathetic in a sense where i know what goes into making a movie uh you know the steps and things like that and it's a tough process it really is so um the movie has to be really insulting to me as, as a as an audience, you know, as a viewer, uh, for me to really like give it a bad review. Um, now, again, th this one right here is a sequel uh, to a movie that I I gave a pretty pretty bad review to when I first watched it. Now, um, I'm willing to give it a chance, but I don't know. <laughs> and that movie is. Fifty Shades Darker. Um, I, you know, I, I watched Fifty Shades of Grey, and I just, it, I wasn't a fan. I really wasn't. Um, mainly, really, the acting is what really got me. Um, they, they don't. The, the, these movies are based upon the relationship of, of the two characters. You know. So you would think that they would have like this strong like chemistry, you know, together in the in the film, 
And that just, it, it wasn't the case. In the original film, I felt like they were just like, like just blank. And uh, Dakota Johnson, not not a really a huge fan of her, of her acting. I, again, I'm willing to give it a shot. I'm going to watch it. I'm going to review it. Um, and, uh, maybe, maybe this one won't be as bad as the first one. I don't know. But with Dakota Johnson, I feel like there's, like, there's nothing there. You know what I mean? I don't know. Like, she's acting and I feel like she's, like, dead in the eyes. It's, it's, I'm trying not to be insulting to her as an actress, but it's, it's just, I don't know. Just something didn't click. I don't know. I don't know if you guys know what I mean. Um, if you, if you do, or if you can maybe explain it a little bit better, than what I'm, I'm trying to put forth. Uh, leave it in the comments below. Let's go ahead and uh, show you the back there. All right. And this one, it is a 4K. It does have the Blu-ray and a digital copy. It includes the unrated edition, which uh, says, um, I don't know. I don't know exactly what's unrated about it, but uh, I'm sure it probably has couple more scenes that were probably cut from the film that were a little too racy uh does also include the theatrical version and uh, it says unmask more with an all-new peak at 50 shades free there's another one <laughs> all right let's go ahead and pop this open and uh, enough with me being a downer about this movie again I'm, I'm gonna i'm willing to give it a shot i really am uh because you know my hopes my hopes are that, you know, movies are good, you know, or decent enough. Um, all right, it does come with digital copy. And, uh, okay. <laughs> Here, here's an invitation if you guys want. You're invited. Fifty Shades Darker Cinematic VR Experience. Be a guest at the Masquerade Ball at, and then it has the, uh, the URL there. So, um... If you, you, you pervs out there want to go ahead and uh, have a cinematic VR experience for Fifty Shades Darker, be my guest. <laughs> and I say pervs in a plain way. <laughs> Alright, so here goes the Blu-ray, which is the typical Universal style Blu-ray that I just talked about. And then the 4K here. 4K does have disc art, which is good. It is the same as the cover. Alright. And... There goes the front, back, and spine for 50 shades darker on 4K Ultra HD. And you can find this one uh, May 9th from Universal Home Entertainment. And I don't, I don't want, I don't want you guys to think I'm a prude either. I'm, I'm not by any means, trust me. But <laughs> all right, I'm again. All right, let's let's continue on. Uh, next up is. Uh, <laughs> is a movie again i get excited when i when i don't know uh about a particular movie or i've never heard of it before um and this is actually a set uh from arrow academy and this is kiju yoshida uh love and anarchism and this comes out may 9th from arrow academy beautiful beautiful uh beautiful set here all right just by looking at it all right and then there goes the side here the spine of it and then there goes the back. If you guys want to see what it's about, you guys can pause it. Let me see. We'll get a little closer so you can read it. All right, you can pause it there. And then the special features or the contents as well. All right, let's go ahead and pop this open. Um, it does come with three discs and a cool booklet. So let me pop this open. I always get excited whenever like these box sets come in. They're so cool. And Arrow does such a fantastic job of producing these things. It's like, they're amazing. All right. All right, so first up, let's see here. Okay, I'm going to assume this is the first one. All right. So Eros, and Eros and Massacre, director's cut. Alright, let's just get this situated. Alright, here goes the Blu-ray. 
And it does say that it's in black and white here, right at the very bottom. I don't know if you guys can see. So just be prepared for that. And then the DVD copy. There as well. Now let's check out the alternate artwork. It's the same. <laughs> it's actually the same as the, uh, the regular artwork, just colorized. Which is pretty cool. Kind of like the black and white one. All right. Go ahead and close this up. All right, next up, the next one is a hero, heroic, heroic purgatory. The next one. All right. Ooh, somebody fell from a parking garage. That's got a sting. <laughs> and then, let's see here, pop it open. Oh, it also actually does come, it looks like it comes with another one. Yeah. Coot. Coot. Okay. I'm going to try to pronounce it. And if, if you guys are, are, if anybody that's watching knows French, because it looks like it's French. Coup d'etat? I don't know. I don't know what that means. But, um, all right. So, here goes the Blu-ray copy, which has both Heroic, heroic Purgatory and Coup d'etat. Uh, on it, and then single DVDs of Heroic Purgatory and Coupe de Tat right there. And I'm gonna assume that, that the alternate artwork is the same, just you know, black and white. Take a look, and yeah, it is still cool though. I like it, All right? And let's go to the next one, and then we'll. we'll let me go to the next one, and then we will come back and um, and look at the special features for all three. All right, next one. And this one's, okay, the uh, theatrical version of uh, Eros Massacre. All right. There we go. Just going to pop this open. Ooh, the thing popped off. All right. So... Here goes the Blu-ray, and then the DVD copy there, All right? And then alternate artwork. I'm gonna assume it's the same. Yep. Just black and white. All right. So let's go ahead and check out the special features on each one. Okay. So we'll go one by one. All right. Next one here. And then last one here. All right. And then here goes the awesome booklet that comes with it. This is really cool. Very beautiful photo there. I love that. And then just blue in the back. And again, much like all the other ones, it's it's a bunch of uh, photos and production notes. Things like that. You can see here. More photos. The girl in the bra. <laughs> and lots of production notes. But a whole lot of stuff here in this booklet as well. And... Uh, and like I said, this one comes out, uh, Kiju Yoshida, is Love and Anarchism, comes out May 9th from Arrow Academy. So definitely look for it then. Look for it then. Um, again, they, they put out some fantastic box sets. And again, the texture thing with me, it just it has that cool matte feeling. You know, love this a lot. Looks great. Looks fantastic. It's, it's going to look awesome on my shelf. I don't have uh, anything pink. And this is definitely going to stand out on, on my... Uh, on my movie shelf back here. So I'm looking forward to actually like having it up there. It's going to look really cool. Alright, next up. And last, but definitely not least, is 310 to Yuma. 
and this is on 4k ultra hd it does have a 4k copy blu-ray and digital hd copy this movie i love this movie uh i remember when it first came out this one uh me and me and a couple of friends had like a uh a western kind of thing going for a while uh we used to always uh rotate between 310 to yuma unforgiven and wyatt earp those are the three movies that we were we would always always watch um so i'm excited that you know this movie is is finally making its way to 4k uh, cannot cannot wait to check this out again it's been it's been a while since i've seen it and then here goes the back here if you guys want to see what it's about if you have not seen it already i highly suggest checking it out great movie uh pre uh pre batman christian bale here and i think this was around the time that uh i might be wrong but this was around the time or like right after the hype of gladiator for russell crowe and this is of course a, a james mangold film so if you love logan uh, and the directing style and, and the way it was you're definitely gonna love this movie and then let's get get closer for the special features here all right let's go ahead and pop this open And it looks, it just looks slick, man. That black case just really looks slick like that. Love it. All right. It does come with digital copy. And then does have disc art on both discs which is really good love that love it when they when they you know pull pull out just a, a little bit of extra yeah i know it, it's it is the same as the cover which is a bit of a bummer uh and they both are the same you know disc art uh but at least there is disc art <laughs> so here's a blu-ray copy and here's a 4k copy and then here goes the front back and spine for 310 to yuma and this one is out now from lionsgate so definitely, definitely, I highly suggest picking this one up. If you have not seen this movie, watch it. This one and Unforgiven. Unforgiven is actually going to be coming out on 4K very soon from Warner Brothers. So I'm looking forward to that as well. Um, so yeah, that's all we got to show you today. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. Hit that like button if you dug any of these titles or if you're thinking about picking up any of these titles, uh, give this video a big thumbs up. It helps the, helps the video get out to a, a wider audience. Um, there will be links down in the description below if you guys want to purchase any of these titles from there uh, You can uh, it's greatly appreciated if you do you don't have to though. They're there though if you like um, And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. You know, we we're we're inching our way closer and closer every day uh, To that 2000 mark and we're almost there. So any subscription helps um, And if you guys you know if you guys are new to the channel and you're this is one of the first videos that you're watching uh, Thank you. Thank you so much and uh Consider hitting that subscribe button. Why not, right? So you, you'll you'll get some up to date stuff for for upcoming releases pretty much every week. So um, so that's something to look forward to. So thank you guys for watching. And with all that being said, we will catch you next time. Bye.